Live from Los Angeles, welcome back to Good Morning La La We are beyond honored to welcome Maxine Smith to the show. She is a iconic contemporary artist and has a great gallery opening this weekend at the Skidmore yes. Contemporary Art Gallery. Tell us a little bit about what you're showing. What I'm showing, uh, this exhibit is called Wives and Lovers. And it's about the wives and lovers of famous artists such as Matisse, um, Picasso, Chagall, uh, let's see who, Klimt, uh, Sheila. And there's something very interesting and powerful about these women who really lived outside the societal oh. lines and boundaries. Can you speak to that a little bit? Uh, absolutely. Um, you know, I think I grew up in the age of innocence and history must repeat itself because there was a freedom during that period from, I'd say, 1918 to 1930 and probably beyond, where these women lived their lives very powerfully. They were the women behind these men in terms of they were the, the men were the artists. Uh, but these women all had careers. They all had lovers. <laughs> they, uh, it was just very interesting, the freedom. One of the artists that I represented, uh, Leonora Fini, was a surrealist. Um, she uh, had a romance with Max Ernst. Mm. Max Ernst later married Peggy Guggenheim, who I also depicted in this exhibit. Um, Leonora Fini, talk about somebody who lived their life. She was known to go out on occasion in a white feathered coat with nothing under it <laughs> and a pair of white boots. I'm sorry, hello. Yeah. I would love it's Friday that. Feels, you know, it we're is. all about it. We actually have a look at some of the pieces that oh, are good. going to be shown. We'd love for you to tell us a little bit about each one of these. Well, that's Leonora <laughs> in her white feathered coat. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. um, of course, I do stylized portraits. So it, it never really is a photograph of someone. Mm -hmm. That woman is um, Emilie Floge, and she was the lover and companion of Klimt. Mm. That's Peggy Guggenheim, who has her own museum. So trendy with her coat. Yeah. Well, she, she wasn't wearing that, but she is. <laughs> when do you remember falling in love and sort of developing a fascination for these wives and mothers of artists? Mm -hmm. You know, it's funny, I was looking at an art auction catalog and there was a picture of Alice B. Toklas and Gertrude Stein. Gertrude Stein, a famous writer. And looking at the two of them, I wondered, what was that relationship all about? And that's actually how I got started because I first wanted to look into them and what they were about. And then after that, I went sailing. <laughs> that was it. Wow. Who's been kind of the muse behind your art? The muse? Well, in terms of artists that I really adore, mm. there are, is that what you're reacting sure. to? Um, I would say uh, Chaim Soutine and Matisse and. Well, there were so many. <laughs> but we'll stop there. It's like choosing your favorite organ. <laughs> That's oh, exactly. Right? Yeah. Exactly. It's so beautiful. Art is, I mean, I think it's a beautiful thing because before we even had television or media, it was the way that we express it. We tell the stories through art. So what is the, I mean, obviously, you are really telling the story of, of their adventure of their life or the empowerment, or what is the, I think what is the biggest takeaway from the story? I would story? say women, mm -hmm. empowerment. Mm -hmm and the lives they lived and the, the freedom that they were able to. And do you feel like you're doing that? I'm hopefully doing that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're looking pretty spunky. You've got some beautiful jewelry uh, on. Thank you. That's I love your hair sweet. and those thank you, glasses. Thank you. You're amazing. So, sweet. Yeah. so tell thank people you. where they can find and see your art. Absolutely. It's uh, the Skidmore Contemporary Gallery at the Bergamot Station, and the address is 2525 Michigan Avenue. My website is MaxineSmithArt.com, uh, Instagram, MaxineSmithArt, <laughs> and that should take you there. There you go. <laughs> that should Thank do you it. so much. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Stay tuned. We'll be right back.